I uh, just wanted to wish you a very happy birthday. When I was trying to think of a memory, there was plenty of things that, that came to mind. All the horse shows you came and watched me at, the Sunday morning pancakes, the pasta lunches, all the fun times we had at the desert house, you teaching me how to golf. But the memory that I thought I'd share was a more recent one. It was at your wedding. Sarah had just gotten on the stage and started seeing what does the fox say? And you looked at me and said, I don't know what to do. And I told you, just dance to Uncle Willie. And you did. And you and I off stage danced to Uncle Willie together. And we had so much fun there at your wedding dancing, the only people on the dance floor at the time. And it reminded me that that's what we do. We have a great time together and we love spending time with one another. And it is one of my most favorite memories of you because you seem so happy. So on that note, uh, thank you for all the amazing times we spent together. And I can't wait to have way more memories with you and way more fun with you. And I love you so much and happy birthday. Hi, dearest Michael, it's Shazara. Wanted to wish you a very happy 70th birthday. You're definitely the youngest 70 year old I know. And you're the most generous. And I love you to bits and pieces. And hope this is a wonderful day, a wonderful time. And I have so much gratitude for all you do in supporting me and so many others. So I love you. I love you. I love you. Happy birthday. Here's Maui. Hey, Mike, it's Bill in New York, thinking of you, wishing you a happy 70th birthday. I hope 70 is a lot better than 69. You had a heck of a year between your feet, your nose, your teeth, everything was falling apart. By now, I think everything's been operated on. There probably isn't anything else left to fix. So I love you, man. You make my time on the West Coast the best. Can't wait to see you in Syrah and um, spend some time in the Mediterranean. Take care, buddy. Happy birthday again. Hello, Michael, and happy birthday. I'm talking to you rather impromptly because I'm at my friendly AT&T store I could not get my computer to work, the, the webcam is kaput. So this is on my iPhone, which is the latest model, you'd be proud of me, and it's working perfectly. So, happy, happy birthday. May there be many, many more happy birthdays to come. I'm so glad that you're my cousin. It's a shame we're 3,000 miles apart, but you are often in my thoughts, and I'll never forget wonderful way that you behaved for my dad in his last years. You never abandoned him, although I know he was quite a cantankerous old fellow in the end. And I'll never forget that trip you made to Arizona for one of Roy's last hospitalizations. And I'll never forget that really awful day when you cleared out Larry's room in dad's apartment. That was a real, real service above and beyond the call of duty. Anyway, my love, I send you a great big hug of my love and many, many happy returns, Carla. Michael, I remember when we first met, it was when you were interviewing me for the financial analyst position at J.H. Snyder in 1997. My first impression was this guy seems pretty laid back and mellow. I think I could go to work for him. Then when you and I were in negotiations with Joe Luce for the Granada Hill sale, um, I had to reconsider my assessment. I remember a flurry of F this and F that and F and this and F and that and F and everything else. And you were yelling as you paced around the office with Joe trying to calm me down over the phone. I thought for sure the deal was done. It was over until Joe conceded all points of contention. Lon, who happened to be in the office at the time, looked at me and said, Welcome to Negotiations 101. I bet they didn't teach this in your business class, did they? It was then that I got to see the passion inside of Michael Wise, too. 
Overall, however, my initial evaluation was correct. You are indeed an easygoing and mellow guy. Somewhat laid back. But, you are the only person I know besides my brother who can pace while he's sitting down. So it was with great respect for you and admiration, both as a boss and as a human being, that I say, Happy birthday, Michael. Stay mellow and enjoy number 70. Remember, having a 70th birthday is better than not. Hi, Michael. I wanted to wish you a happy birthday from Vancouver. I wish I was there celebrating with you guys. I hope that you're surrounded by love and open hearts. And I really hope to see you guys soon. I also want to thank you for making me always feel welcome and like part of the family. Happy birthday. Happy birthday, Michael Weiss. It's your 35th anniversary of your 35th birthday. And I uh, just want to wish you all the best. Uh, from Jenny, Graylin, and Michael, we love you lots and hope you get 70 more years. Hugs and kisses. Happy birthday. Happy birthday to you, Michael. Ciao. I'm really proud uh, to know you. You are one of the most uh, wonderful person I know, and the reason is uh, very clear to me. You are very normal person. That's real wisdom. You are a person that never boasts, never grandiose, very, very willing to listen and to speak the truth. I'm proud to be your friend and I see you really as a healthy influence in the life of other people. Uh, happy birthday, Michael. I love you. And you're my best friend. Well, Michael, behind me is some of the skyline that you and Jerry have helped create during your career at J.H. Snyder Company. I want to wish you a happy birthday. You're one of my oldest and best clients, and I appreciate it very much. And maybe now at age 70, I can't believe that, you'll be able to shoot your age. Happy birthday, Michael. Hello, Michael. It's Dudley from the club. Remember when I caddy for you? Yeah. Well, we had some good time together, so I wanted to wish you a happy birthday. <laughs> Remember that time you were in the sand? Oh, I can't tell that story, but happy birthday, Dundee Dupeldorfer here from the club. <laughs> Hey, Mike, happy birthday. Happy birthday, pal. I couldn't let Dean get the last word or maybe any word. I don't or know. Or the first word. <laughs> the first word. <laughs> anyway, it's been my pleasure to know you for nearly 35 years. And I can remember when we first met, you guys were like Felix and Oscar living together. I think Dean was folding your socks and you were playing golf. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> we were blessed to have our wedding at your house in the backyard. It was absolutely gorgeous. In fact, I have a little memento here of the uh, the day. There you are. My gosh, didn't we have hair? We all had hair. <laughs> and that was, gosh, 31, almost 32 years ago. Anyhow, we look back on all these times, the boat, the boat rides we had when you and Dean had the Duffy boat, but honestly, it didn't even take a special occasion. Our, our friendship itself has been special enough over all these years, and we have enjoyed every moment of the time that we share together. Absolutely. Absolutely. And I remember another boat ride we took with the Ellemeyers when we got down to Ensenada. Well, after one night on the boat, you looked at me on Saturday morning and said, let's get the out of here oh we'll fly to vegas i think that was a carnival cruise <laughs> right up your alley huh anyway mike we don't know a more generous a kinder more giving person than you you are good to the Absolutely. core and it is our pleasure and privilege to share this friendship and this love that we have for you absolutely pal and my 
very good fortune to be able to call you my dearest and best friend for more than 35 years. You bet. And, uh, you know, it was just wonderful that we came together. Uh, I remember teaching you Visical and uh, <laughs> on a early, early Apple computer and uh, you helping get my business going. And, oh man, I'll tell you what, it just, um, uh, it's been really good for, uh, for me. And so, being the older person in this group, I think uh, uh, I'll older. say I hope that you and I get another 70 years together. So, happy, love you. Happy birthday, Michael. Happy we love birthday. you. Bye. Happy, happy birthday, birthday, Michael. Thank you so much for being a wonderful husband to Sarah and a fabulous stepdad to so many young people, including my daughter, and a wonderful dear friend to me. Michael, I um, I just remember so many wonderful breakfasts and meals we've shared together over the years um, in your home that you've generously opened to me so many times, and I feel like your family, and I'm grateful to know you and your family, and love you. Yeah. Okay. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Hope from it's New a good one. From New York from New York City. City. Bye. Michael, come on, get up. Good morning, honey. Come on, wake up, honey. Come on, today's a big day. You don't know what today is? Not really, no. Why, what is it? Michael, why is today such a big day? Come on, you've got to remember. Uh, let me see. Something, uh, uh, some big day today. Jeez. I don't know. I, I, I'm getting old here. That's it. Now that's a clue. Someone's getting older today. Somebody's older today. Somebody's older today. Uh, oh, oh, oh all right, all right. Uh, somebody's birthday. Yes, yes. Uh, somebody's okay. birthday. <laughs> right, somebody's birthday. <laughs> Uh, all right, well, let me think about it, and I'll figure that out. All right, somebody's birthday today. Okay, let me ask Obi. Hey, hi, Obi. How you doing? How's it going this morning? Hey, looking pretty good there, pal. Uh, hey, your mom says uh, it's something special today here. You have any idea what it is? No. No? Okay. All right, well, thanks. Bye. All right, so it's somebody's birthday I'm supposed to know this, but at this point, uh, I'm going to need a clue. Oh, Michael, you're a wise man. You should know this. All right, I'm a wise man. I should know this, but uh, I, you know, I forgot. So give me another clue. Okay. He's a really great guy. Everybody loves him. Uh, he's a great guy. Everybody loves him. That would be... John F. Kennedy. Oh, good guess, though. But nope, not him. Uh, oh, I know, I know. He's he's very good looking. He's a handsome guy. He's a handsome guy, handsome guy. Right. Everybody loves him. He's a handsome guy. Uh, uh, handsome guy, good looking. George Clooney. <laughs> Close, but nope. No? Okay. Uh, okay, here's another one. He's a big family man. He loves his family. Loves his family. Big family man. Good looking. Everybody likes him. Brad Pitt. <laughs> okay, here's one. Maybe you can get it from this. Uh, he is very generous. He's generous to his friends. He gives a lot to charity. Bill Gates. No, not Bill Gates. <laughs> Dale Carnegie. Oh, Michael, he's been dead for a hundred years. Come on, this man is very much alive. Okay. And he happens to be one of your great friends. He's one of my great friends? Yes. Well, you might have mentioned that. He's one of my great friends. He's a good-looking guy. He's getting older. It's his birthday. He's a family man. Uh, everybody loves him. That's gotta be. 
It's yes, Michael Wise's 70th birthday. birthday! Yay! Yay. Happy, Happy birthday, birthday Michael. Michael! Have a great day! Uh, we hope you're having a fantastic day. Happy birthday! We love you! Ready to go! Hey, you don't look too bad like that. Oh, yeah, well, maybe I could keep this on for a while. <laughs> it is a pretty good look for me. Happy birthday, Michael. Yeah, you probably just want this face all to yourself. Okay. Happy birthday! Bye! Great. Well, happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Michael. Happy birthday to you. Well, Michael, I'm so happy to be asked to be one of the 250 and then some friends of you, the nearest and dearest to you, to celebrate your birthday. Michael, we are good friends for a long time and I enjoy every day of our friendship. Particularly those evenings every month that we go to the ponies and polish a good bottle of Castello Bumpy wine. Michael, those evenings you're telling me stories and jokes that I hope they both forget when we leave the restaurant. Um, Michael, I want to wish you uh, lots of health and continuous success in all what you do. You're good at it and everybody appreciate it. And uh, I would like you to uh, be with all of us to celebrate uh, our birthday when we cross our zip code from 69 to 70. Until then, all the best, keep well, and keep celebrating life. It's a good journey, man. And together, it makes it even better. Happy birthday, Michael. Hey, Dad. I just wanted to wish you a happy 70th birthday. You know, it sounds kind of weird saying it because it sure doesn't seem like you're 70, but I guess that means I've got some good genes. Um, maybe we should buy you that gray hair dye so you can finally look the part. <laughs> uh, so, I was trying to think of some of my fondest memories of us uh, when I was growing up, but I guess I've known you for quite some time now, so it's kind of hard to pinpoint one. Um, but I guess I would have to say that my favorite memories were probably just coming home from school every night, waiting for you to get home, uh, to challenge you to a game of ping pong which often got pretty competitive. Um, we're playing basketball in the backyard, waiting for the Melodeus to yell at us to go inside because it's too late at 8.30. Um, going down to the beach, uh, playing some football, trying to get around you, which I probably wasn't too great at until I was 15 or 16. <laughs> um, you know, even some of my stranger memories, uh, taking your Lexus down to that scrub and dub car wash down in Sepulveda, um, when I decided that it was a better idea if I started washing the floor with their brushes instead of your car, and getting yelled at by that old man, um, that was kind of funny because I knew right then that even if I was screwing up, my dad's still got my back. <laughs> um, I don't know what else. Let's see. Um, I just want to say that I hope you have a great 70th birthday. And, uh, you know, I couldn't wish for a better dad. You're always there for me. Uh, and I love you. Happy birthday, Dad. Hi, Michael. Just wanted to wish you a happy birthday and a wonderful year. Wish we could be there to celebrate with you, and we hopefully will uh, see you very soon. Thanks for being a great brother-in-law. Love you, and I'll talk to you soon. Happy birthday. Bye. Happy birthday, Brother Michael. On this day, I am sending you all my love and hopes that there will be many more just like it. Together, we have shared so many wonderful experiences. We have laughed and cried and played and worked, loved and grieved and lived and learned. 
We've run rivers, skied mountains, and played sports. We've toasted each other at our weddings. We've raised our families and watched our children become adults. Through it all, we remained a family. Our mom would be proud of what we built. Thank you for all your support these many years and for being there when I needed a helping hand. I am proud to call you my brother. Happy birthday. Hello, Uncle Michael. This is your nephew, David, wishing you a happy birthday. Uh, I just want to let you know that uh, you are one of the uh, most intriguing, interesting people I know. Um, your charisma just exudes off of you. Um, ever since I was a kid, I've always admired your, your way with people, um, just your, your ability to lighten up a room and make people have fun around you. Um, I think my fondest memory of this actually happening is at my dad's wedding, uh, watching the first time I've ever seen anyone do, I think what you called the Uncle Wiggly, which has been the precursor for all my dance moves ever since to uh, varying degrees of success. Um, that, you know, I was watching you have like, the time of your life out there and getting other people engaged. I think it really uh, added a lot to the night and uh, it's a good example of how you add a lot to every, every night. Um, so here's to you and happy birthday. May there be many more. Yep, 70, you hit it before me. As usual, older, older, older. Too many memories after 55 years. Have a great birthday and friendship lasts forever. Bye-bye. Happy birthday, Dad. I feel so blessed to have been able to have you as my father and so grateful for all the amazing time that we've had together. It's really been a special life that you've given me and I feel lucky that I got to have so much time with you when I was young and all those really amazing times we had together, um, the trips we took, so many of them, especially remember um, that first amazing trip we took to New York and DC, hunting around for Eloise and taking trains and doing things that were really, really special. And as an adult, uh, I really look to you as an inspiration, as a parent. Um, you've really guided how I want to raise my own children, and uh, you've been such a strong support for me, um, both as a child and as an adult, and I just feel really grateful for you. And so lucky that I got to be your daughter. Happy birthday. I love you so much. This is such an exciting birthday, and I can't wait to celebrate many, many more with you. I love you. Happy birthday, Mike. On your birthday, I would like to give you five birthday tips on how to be the number one boss. And number one is try not to be late. And yes, you will have to work on it. And number two, please. Do not go home without signing checks. Number three, if you can't make it to work and you call in sick, do reply to emails. Number four, if you go on vacation, please reply to emails. And number five, clarification, please reply to my emails. You will be number one boss in no time. And of course, I can only get away with my obnoxious comments because I have the most considerate, the most noble, the most intelligent boss. I still remember the first time I walked into your office um, 17 years ago, and it seems like yesterday, but I remember back then I was a nervous wreck. Don't ask me now. I remember thinking, he seems pretty nice. And today, I can honestly say that you are the most admirable person I've known. And I am very grateful for having you to mentor me and, yes, even to torture me. 
many times torture me. And um, so many years, I mean, we've gone over what? The Marina City Club, and we've gone over towns, West Hollywood, the river, my favorite, Huntington Beach, Howard Hughes, the water garden. And now here we are in construction, and I have to say that you are an absolutely, an absolute great leader. And I am very fortunate, again, to work for you. I remember once telling you that Jake Schneider was my second home, and you said, no, it's your first home. You spend more time here than at home. This is actually your first home. And today, I would like to tell you that as a member of your family, that there are no options absolutely none when it comes down to retirement. So please dismiss any ideas, if any, about retirement. We still have 20 more years to go, 20 more years of challenges to overcome, and 90 is just around the corner. Time passes by fast. Mike, um, on another note, happy birthday. <laughs> You truly are the most extraordinary person I've met, and I am very fortunate to have a little tiny place in your life. You have certainly enriched mine by giving me the opportunity to grow within your company every year that I've been here. And every day that you are here, it's my birthday, and we truly, I truly appreciate you. Work calls. Bye. Hey, Mike. Happy birthday. Glad to be able to uh, share some greetings with you. I was going to call you when we got back from California, but I couldn't stand the idea of having to listen to you harass me about being so much younger than I am. So uh, at this point, I guess I can say welcome to your eighth decade. Uh, I'm glad we're able to share it together and uh, one of the great uh, gifts of uh, my uh, my life uh, was having you come back into it after 40 years of uh, uh, being out of touch and um, to be able to spend time with you and your family and watching your kids grow and us grow all together has uh, just been a great gift. Just looking forward to seeing you in September. Happy birthday. We have many fond and favorite memories of Michael. with Michael. Like, Michael, remember the time when you and Paul and I, back in Fountain Valley, went to lunch together and you and Paul had a rather heated discussion, a business discussion, but a heated discussion, and Paul decided that it would be better for him to walk home, so he left our lunch and walked back to the office about two miles. We stayed at the restaurant to cool, let him cool off a little, went back, and when we got there, we found out he was still a little hot under the collar. So he came and he said to you, he said, Michael, let's settle this right now. And you looked at him with his fist up and you said, and, and you looked at him, you stepped back and you started laughing hysterically. That was the end of that argument. So that is one, that is a one-time image. Another image of Michael is one that over the last 40 years has repeated itself from time to time on the golf course. Michael is by far the superior golfer of David and I. He hits his woods much further and he's very accurate with his irons. But from time to time, the flat stick abandons him on the golf course. And it is up to Dave and I when he is looking at a three foot downhill put, putt and Michael thinks we're gonna give it to him and David and I look at each other and remind Michael of other times when he has missed the putt. So Michael finally takes the putter back and does not scare the hole. Needless to say, what Michael utters then will not be repeated. But David and I do get a good chuckle. Michael, this is a picture that I keep in my office of the three of my boys when they were very, very, very young. Are you going to finish what the other thing you were going to say about that? No. no. Come on. <laughs> no. I'm not going to She's say. not going to finish that. 
Michael, Michael you are the best. best. Just work on those pressure, pressure putts. putts. Happy 70th. This is Carl. Just wanted to wish you a happy 70th birthday. And as our um, sage mentor, Dick Samia, would say, people who live to be 70 went like 40 when they were 20. So have a great day. Take care. Bye. Happy birthday, Mike. Hope you have a wonderful birthday. And now you are joining the 70 Club, which I guess is a senior club. Um, I hope you have a wonderful time with Dean and Cindy. And uh, everything you want comes true. <laughs> I mean, I had a lot more prepared, but then you <laughs> hearing it many times uh, today. But I just want to wish you a really great day um, on you know your birthday. Uh, you're 70 times around the sun. You look great. And I'm not just paying you lip service on that, Mike. You really do. And thank you for being just such a great person. I honor you on this day um, for all the things that you've accomplished and all the things you've done in your life um, and all the people you've really helped along the way. You're just a great person, man. And I'm super grateful and I'm super happy that you're all part of our lives. So enjoy yourself, eat a lot of birthday cake, and uh, have fun. Happy birthday. Happy birthday, Michael. We all want to wish you the best birthday ever and tell you how much we love you and are so blessed to have you as a, a family member and a brother-in-law. And we send our love and hugs and kisses and hope you have the best birthday ever and many, many more, many years of good health and happiness. Big hugs and kisses. We love you. Michael. As you get older, you gain knowledge, tolerance, and serenity. But can you recall it when you need it? Mm, maybe, but when you turn 70, ooh, trouble. You certainly don't look like it. You don't act like it. So uh, when he calls back, when you're really turning 70, because we don't, I don't believe it. Not true. Um, happy birthday! I guess you're turning 60, maybe, but definitely not 70. So uh, happy birthday, and uh, we'll talk to you when you're when you're 70. Hi, Michael. <laughs> happy birthday. I hope you have the most wonderful, wonderful birthday with better health. And I, I believe that you're the nicest person I know, the handsomest, the most, uh, oh, um, best nature that I've ever met. Uh, I, I can't say enough about you. I think you're just wonderful and you deserve the best. Okay, happy birthday for the next hundred years. Okay, take care. Love you, and have a great day. This is a tribute to Uncle Mike. Happy 70th. Feel our love. 
When evening shadows and the stars appear And there was no one to save your fears Oh, we could embolden you for trillion years To make you feel our love We know you haven't made your golf swing perfect But we would never judge you wrong, wrong. We've known your life potential from the earliest moments No doubt in our minds how hard you were gone the whole family go hungry, we go black and blue. We each go crawling down the avenue. And there is nothing that we wouldn't do to make you feel our love. Hey, Michael, happy birthday. Happy 70th. Um, I cannot believe that you are 70 years old. Um, you look so young to start. Second, you probably can still win at arm wrestling. Three, you still rock it down the slopes. Four, you can put most people under the table in the tequila drinking contest. And five, you still can you know, have the claim that you, uh, you shook Matthew McConaughey's hand stronger. That's something to be very proud of. Um, anyways, if I had to um, to reflect on a memory, there's there's so many great memories that I have with you. Um, you know, it's it's easy to pull from the slopes. It's uh, you know, it's easy to pull maybe the uh, the memory where I uh, I bet you five hundred dollars that I could make a shot with a frisbee into a basketball hoop. You know, and you never paid me. But, um, you know, I made it. But uh, actually, the, the, the memory that stood out first was uh, when I was in town for spring break with my friend and met uh, Corinne and David out for sushi. And, of course, they picked the sushi restaurant. And we show up at this swanky sushi restaurant. And I'm used to that sushi being 20 bucks or 30 bucks. And our bill came, and it was like $300. It was so expensive for me at that time spring break, Prescott College, and, um, you know, right after the bill came, and I, like, you know, I had to swallow my tongue all of a sudden, you know, you showed up and paid the bill. Um, out of nowhere, you didn't even have any food whatsoever, you just showed up and paid the bill. Um, you know, and I think it, it's just a testament to the kind of person you are. Um, you're a caretaker, and you take care of everybody. And I think that, you know, it, it means the world. You mean so much to so many people um, because of your gener generosity, your spirit, your, your warmth, you know, and, and friendliness and, and your protector. Um, and so nice to have you as an uncle, uh, someone with those qualities as an uncle. Um, and I love you. I love you so much. So, on this uh, 70th birthday, I wish you, you know, everything that you've given to everyone else uh, throughout your life. I wish you that and more. And I, I just wish you a beautiful day, uh, just a wonderful day, and, uh, and all the love in the world. Love you, Michael. Happy birthday. Bye-bye. Hi, Michael. I just want to wish you a very happy 70th birthday. I am so grateful to be working for someone as generous and kind as you. I really feel like I'm the lucky one here, so I really hope you have a great day. Happy birthday. Hey, Papa Wise. Just wishing you a happy and healthy birthday. Thank you for letting me into your family and letting me bug you every weekend. I love all the time that we spend together, and especially when I get to beat you at all those Sudoku challenges and prove you wrong. Happy birthday. Happy birthday, Michael. I'm so grateful to be included in this video uh, tribute because I admire so many things about you. I admire that you were so brave to go out to California on your own at a very young age and make a tremendous success 
out of your life on so many levels. I admire your devotion to your family, your children, that you found Sarah, and that you were so tremendous to Oppie all of those years. It meant a lot to all of us. I admire that you have done so much for, for the youth with your youth centers, and you're very humble about that, but um, just on the whole, you have impacted so many lives in a very positive way, including my own. And I thank you for all of the great uh, laughs that you've given me through the years, too. You're a very funny person. So I'm just happy to be part of celebrating your, your birthday, Michael, and I hope it's a wonderful one, just like you. Bye. Hello, Michael. Happy 75th or 79th or whatever it is. It's been an honor knowing you over the last 35 years, and you've done many, many, many impressive things. However, in retrospect and thinking about it, by far and away the most impressive was when you had that wonderful party and managed to have two ex-wives and Sarah all smile in a picture surrounding you. You must be one hell of a man. They all still love you, and so do we. Happy birthday. Hi, Michael. Happy birthday to you. Feliz cumpleaños. Que cumplas muchos más. Bye. Hello, Uncle Michael. We wish you all the best. I hear it's your 70th birthday. And I'm uh, wishing you happy 70th birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. I just want to wish you a happy birthday. I can't swear here. I can't do anything. I can't have fun because we don't know who's going to be seeing this. But I can't believe you're 70. You actually look older, but I can't believe you're 70. Anyway, I just want to thank you so much for everything you've done for me. I love you, and I hope you have a fantastic day. Happy birthday! Happy birthday to you! Happy birthday to you! Ta 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 again! Happy birthday to your la 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 love, Papa! Happy birthday to you! Hot chocolate! Papa Pancake Day! Um, 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 I love coming to your Happy house. birthday, Papa! Happy Papa birthday, Pancake Papa. Day! Papa Pancake Day! Papa, we love you so much! <laughs> Happy birthday! Papa Pancake Day! Happy birthday! Papa Pancake Who wants to say something they love about Papa? I love that you're I love always being your nice. Ass. I love that you're always being nice. You're so sweet. I, I love coming to your house. Air hug and high five and kiss. We like you for you. Yes, Um. I like coming to your house because you were like the first time. Thank you, Dad. Apparently they like your house. All right, Papa. We wish you and a very, very... And I like very... swimming in your pool with you. We wish you a very, very... Yeah, me too, me too. Happy, Happy birthday. birthday. Happy birthday. Happy Papa. birthday. Let us know. Happy birthday, Michael. As your queen and beloved bride, I get to wish you a happy birthday and want you to know that I am so thankful to be living this fairy tale life with you. I'm thankful for how much you care for me, for the incredible fun that we have together, for the wonderful trips that we take, this lavish lifestyle we live, this beautiful home that we share, and especially grateful for the extended family that we have, the kids I get to love, Danielle, Charlie, Corinne, Justin, Kaya, David, and that we get to spend time as a family and share each other's lives. You know, as a young girl, I had hoped and longed for a partnership, a companion, and a friend, and someone that I could trust and feel safe with, and who I would respect. And it took me two tries to get to here with you. Um, and I've never been so happy in my life, and so in love. Going through life with you is an incredible experience and a great joy and a great honor. I am so thankful for the fatherly love that you give my children 
and the generous support that you offer them and how much you consider who they are and what their needs are. So my love, my beloved, may all the moments of the rest of your days be filled with magic and wonder. May you know that you are so deeply loved by all who are lucky to get to know you and be in your circle. May you know that with everything that I have in my heart to love you, I love you so deeply and profoundly and cherish every day that we get to spend together. I don't take it for granted. I cherish every morning waking up with you and every night going to sleep with you. I wish you so much love on this special occasion and hope that you are beaming with joy right now as you experience all the energy that's coming your way and that you feel a tremendous amount of glee and joy and laughter and celebrate the sweetness of this moment and know that you are one of the most kind, loving, generous, supportive people I've ever met and I get to be with you. So thank you for being my beloved and thank you for everything that you have given me and offer me and happy birthday. Love you so much. Mwah.